California Republicans are ramping up efforts to fight a proposal to tax the state's drinking water. One America's Sonia Natoa has more on that bill and why some Californians are against it. California already has the highest tax burden in the country, and now Governor Gavin Newsom is looking to add a new tax to the state's drinking water, a proposal which has been highly criticized across the state. They want to put taxes on everything, it seems like, everything. And now drinking water, which is something that's a necessity to survive. Newsom included the tax in his budget blueprint, saying it would create a safe and affordable drinking water fund to help disadvantaged communities clean contaminated water systems. Supporters of SB 623 say residents would only be taxed 95 cents a month in an effort to raise about $110 million a year for the fund. And Newsom is determined to make sure the proposal goes through after a similar measure failed under former Governor Jerry Brown. We're going to have to fix this. And I have no interest in everybody making an excuse of not doing it this year. And if we fall short again, that's on us. And that's a disgrace and that's shameful. So we're going to have to figure it out. Opponents say the improvements shouldn't require a new tax and instead should be funded by existing state revenue, as well as taxes on industrial groundwater polluters. We oppose misguided efforts to force Californians to pay a tax on drinking water, a basic human necessity. Opponents are also concerned the bill could lead to additional taxes on drinking water in the future. The legislation would require two-thirds majority in both houses in order to pass. Sani Unato, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.